y'all. I am here in the office. Here in the office. I have something serious to talk about. It's Christmas time. <laughs> y'all, they have Christmas trees out already. Y'all, I'm in Hobby Lobby. Look at all this cute fall decor. That is so cute. I love fall, y'all. Hey, y'all. So Ross always has the best paintings and portraits. Absolutely gorgeous. I just want to show y'all a few. Look at this one. It has butterflies on it. Isn't she gorgeous? Ooh. Hey y'all, it's Sierra. So I am getting ready to go to my neurology appointment. I have my six month checkup today. Everything has been going great since I was able to get back on my treatment that was working, which is Abagio. So everything's been going great. I look forward to having a great report and I will see y'all in there. Bye. Yeah, I want to show y'all something really quick. This is the mobile MRI machine that um, they do their MRIs in. I know I got my MRI done in this plenty of times. And this is one of the machines that I got my MRI done in um, when I was first diagnosed with MS. Now I go to, um, I go to a center now because I'm with another um, healthcare organization. But yeah, this is a mobile MRI. It looks like a little tractor trailer <laughs> with wheels, but um, it has an MRI scanner machine in there. So it's amazing, y'all. Alrighty, that's what it looked like. I'm here in the um, the lobby, I just finished getting checked in. Of course, when I come here and it's like a follow-up, I always have to, they give me a list of like medications um, and I have to just update my medication list and let the nurse know um, what I'm taking and um, as well as my neurologist, um, give them an update on what I'm taking in regards to medicine, but I'm doing well. I'm just ready to, a um, little bit of the, I was ready to get this appointment over with. Because I am stable, I am seeing um, the nurse practitioner today. I know I see my neurologist, you know, kind of like as needed if I'm having a problem. But because I've been stable for years, I still have my issues from time to time. Um, I see the nurse practitioner. So I see him, the, uh, the first part of the six months and the second part of the six months, I see um, the nurse practitioner that he's working with, um, that will that works with him. But like I said, y'all, I'm hoping this is gonna be a good, good um, doctor's appointment. I've been doing well. I've, of course, I've had my body has got had to get readjusted to our Baggio again, so that has been um, a little annoying and difficult at the same time. But God is good. Just ready to get it over with y'all ready to get it over with okay hey, y'all i am here in the office here in the office and um <clears throat> nurse she's really great i've always have a have a great time talking with her she was actually the first nurse that was with me when i was diagnosed with multiple sclerosis when i came to the neurology center so it's just amazing that she's still here and Still helping people living with multiple sclerosis be their best self. And she also helped me a lot when it came to the appeals process because there was paperwork that had been had to be sent to my insurance company and it was a mess. Ooh, pharmaceutical company, insurance company, it was a mess, y'all. But I'm gonna go ahead and get this assessment done. I don't think I'm gonna be able to record that, but it should be easy peasy today. Yep. But I'm here, y'all. Okay, see so y'all in a little bit. I'm gonna let y'all know how it turns out. Bye. I am a fan of Christmas. I love Christmas, of course. I know the reason for the season. So y'all, they got the Christmas trees I look. All right, look, they doing this right before Halloween, right? Just getting it all out. So look at this large tree. I'm in Costco's though. It is the season, y'all. I love myself some Christmas, so I, I seen that and I got excited. I can look, got these big ornaments. <laughs> Ooh, y'all look at this. Ooh, I can't wait to tell mom. Cause me and mom, we are, we love Christmas. What is this? This is a Christmas, peanut Snoopy Christmas tree. Y'all, 
so I'm getting ready to decorate my room, right? And I'm going to decorate it so it'll have like a fall thing to it, but y'all, I'm also gonna have a Christmas thing too, so stay tuned for that. Ooh, they got some pretty reeds, y'all. Look, I came here for some salmon. But see, they know what they be doing. They, they trying to get us in, um, in the season, right, of giving. Oh, y'all, this is cute. Anyways, y'all, let me get out of here and finish get, um, and get this salmon. Because y'all know I'm trying to eat better. We're trying to do better, right? So I'm just getting so excited about Christmas time. Ah. Look, I already, look, me and my mama, we, we've been watching movies really before, before July. So, because we're, you know, big fans, y'all. But let me go ahead and get, um, get my salmon. And I will talk with y'all later, but I'm just so excited about it. <laughs> yeah, I'm in Target, so I guess it's, it's pumpkin season. Because, you know, fall will be here this Saturday. So, y'all, they got pumpkin spice Philadelphia cream cheese. Are they taking it too far with this, y'all? This whole little section is like a pumpkin caramel yogurt. What is this? Some type of, oh, naturally flavored cookie dough. Pumpkin spice. Of course, you got the Halloween stuff, pumpkin that, ghost stuff over there. Pumpkin, pumpkin munchkin. Is this pumpkin spice craze too much, y'all? Yes or no? <laughs> oh, zero sugar, got a little gingerbread man up here, wow. All right, y'all, I wonder how these taste. But guess what? They're pumpkin. Well, no, they're maple. They're maple. Okay. <laughs> Again, y'all. Again. Pumpkin spice crisp cookies. Pumpkin spice cookie bites. Pumpkin spice dip. Now, these companies just taking advantage of, of, of pumpkin flavored things. What do y'all think? <laughs> what is this, y'all? Look. It's like a kettle. Kettle. Uh, pumpkin spice kettle corn. Ugh. One thing about it, everybody's pumpkin spice ain't good, y'all. I right, put that up. All right. This is different. Caramel apple. Okay. Oh, little little pumpkins. Look, sour orange gummy pumpkins. can't lie y'all I love I absolutely love the fall so I love seeing it I enjoy seeing what what things they come up with all right so I have to get a printer y'all have to get a wireless printer so that's what I'm in target for but yeah I love the festivities you know I'm not a fan of Halloween but if you are that's your thing. I'm a fan of Christmas, y'all. So, it's a little shopping today. So, for the ones who do the Hallelujah night or the or the trick or treating, we got plenty of stuff still left. Oh, again, y'all. Again. Let's see. Do you have anything pumpkin? Or am I just picking? Do y'all think I'm just picking? <laughs> oh, y'all. When I was a child, I ate so much candy corn, y'all. Honey, I'm, I am a candy corn. <laughs> I have a candy corn. Mm, this don't look too good, y'all. What is this? It says caramel and crunch dipping tray. Ugh. Got to look at your little cookies and pretzels. That don't look too good. But y'all, candy corn was like my parents' favorite. And apparently school's favorite. Because, honey, that's all I had all the time, candy corn. So I ate so much candy corn, honey, I turned into a candy corn. So I, I will eat them, won't be eating no more candy corn as an adult. Right. Okay, I'm gonna get to this printing printer section. Y'all look at this what I just what I fixed. So yeah, y'all I fixed this. Can y'all believe this? I told y'all look I was trying to do right. So I was cooking for me and mom. If y'all hear a dog barking that's joy, she wants to she wants to um get outside her little playpen. But um I took some cucumbers. I took cucumbers and tomatoes and 
some salad dressing. I, I'll let y'all know what it is. It's like a um, lemon flavor salad dressing. And I put that in it. And then I found this recipe, this chickpea recipe, which I will put in the description. And then, y'all, I got the um, Costco salmon that they pre-make. And I just put that in the oven. I cooked it. And fortunately, mom had gotten, had, um, had some sauce from another dish that she had got. It was from the frozen food section, but it was an additional pack of, it was an additional pack of sauce. And I'll put it in the description as well, but that was good. So this is like a spicy um, sesame seed, um, ginger type sauce over the salmon. And then I took some zucchini and some spinach. I cut up garlic cloves and, um, some spring onions in it, y'all. It is really good. And I add some chicken broth to it. But yeah, this is this is healthy eating, y'all. I'm I told you I'm trying. And um I know what has helped me out tremendously is watching the things that I eat. Um I do exercise, but I'm telling you, like, it's kind of pointless to exercise and you eat wrong because you're gonna be sluggish and you're not gonna have the energy. And I was battling with all those things. So I'm like, when I work out. I want to start feeling better. So that's why I decided that I needed to eat better. I want to take my health serious. We taking our health serious, y'all. All right, y'all take care. Bye-bye. So y'all, I need to upgrade my room. I need to upgrade my office. I definitely want to change my bedding. I want to change my curtains. It was like a beach thing that I had, but now I'm ready to just change it to a more modern um chic slash bohemian type style room i love color and that's what i want in my room so my room is gonna have a little bit of everything in it but i want to have more i want it to like feel more homey and i need to upgrade my office because i'm gonna be in my office a lot in really now um in the next few weeks i'm going to be in my office a lot so i have to get <laughs> i have to get something y'all but i love this time of season so it is fall already so what i would like to do i am like a cheapskate y'all so i'm going to go around to a couple of stores that i love to go to i don't know if i'll get to roses today but i'm gonna go to dollar general i went to dollar tree yesterday they didn't have much home decor but dollar general does around this time really they, they've been pretty good the last few years with home decor and of course i want to maybe if i have time i will try to swing by walmart to see what they have but i'm gonna go from there y'all i'm gonna try to my room doesn't need too much done to it it's just that i want like some different things that i can like put on the wall i know i want things like more storage right so i'm gonna try to if i even if i have to like get get a few cabinets or just get something i don't know y'all but i looked on pinterest for some ideas so i'm gonna go from there but y'all gonna come along with me to go shopping today yay and listen it's the most wonderful time of the year as y'all can see in the previous in the previous uh, in the previous clips that I had before this, y'all, they already got Christmas stuff up. Like I said, I'm not a fan of Halloween, um, but I love the fact that they're putting out Christmas stuff earlier. I'm sure the businesses love it because they have the marketing in advance and getting people ready for the season. And of course, I know the reason for the season, but I just love seeing it, all right? So y'all gonna go with me to the store. See y'all a little bit. Bye. All right, y'all. I just got to Wally World. So I'm gonna go in the home section and see what they have. See if I can pick up anything. All right, see y'all a little bit. Y'all, this is what they have. But I'm telling y'all, like, I'm not feeling inspired. I um, think that I'm gonna have to maybe get some, some decor first. And then based off of that, like some home decor besides curtains. Curtains may be the last thing that I choose, y'all. Yeah, this ain't, um, it didn't give what it was supposed to be giving. 
Mm-mm. I'm gonna have to see what else they got, y'all. Because one thing about like my blinds and curtains and stuff, I wanted to almost have like kind of like a neutral color like this, but I want it to be like a little lighter like that. And, and I can add maybe like some shears to it, like some colorful shears. Just, I don't know. Maybe I'm looking for something more neutral like this, y'all, because I want to have like pops of color in my in my office slash room. Okay, so I think the next place I'm going to check out, but I want to look at the prices. The prices aren't too bad um, for two panels. It's not bad at all for two panels. It's ten dollars, but also too, I got to look at the got to look at the height as well. Like I have really tall, I have really high like window panels, but I don't like my curtains to drag. Like I don't, I don't like for my curtains to drag like that. I like them to be like a little shorter like this. Well, probably not like that. Probably not like that, but something that's like about like right here. Cause I don't have too much room to work with, but I got a little bit of room. I don't know. Just want something like like that looks like clean and clean, modern. All right, y'all. I'm gonna go on to the next section. Okay, y'all. Now I'm in the comforter and bedding section, and I'm still not inspired. Like I love turquoise and blue, but I just want to move away from that and get something that looks a bit little bit more neutral with pops of color uh, I don't like this color but uh, the style is kind of cute I like that little furry pillow I don't want anything I don't want too much pink and something different all right y'all now, when I came in, I seen something that I want to show y'all. But I want to see if they have any, like, home decor. Let's see. Let's see. Mm, this is... What would I do with this though? I like the gold, but I don't know what I'll do with it. I'm definitely gonna check out Ross and see what they have. Let's see if they got better. I know Ross has some good home decor. Today will be a great day. Okay. Hmm. Let me see these little plants here. What is that? Okay. Oh, this is kind of cute, but I want something that's more colorful than this. I want something that's more, has more color. Oh, look at this little birdie. <laughs> okay. Now, y'all, Walmart has started putting out their Christmas stuff, too. They got some more things to fill in. It's still early, y'all. still early. I've always wanted a little mini Christmas tree. I might get one this year. If just put in my room and decorate it. Oh, they got little mini ornaments for the Christmas tree. I might do that this year, y'all. Look, it's not, it's not even October yet. Look, Halloween season happening even even passed. That's cute. The little weenie dogs. Let's see. Y'all need to get out this section. I I, I didn't even. I came in here for one thing and looking at other things I shouldn't be looking at right now. Oh, that is so cute. So you can put it on like the little, um, these mini ornaments on a little Christmas tree or you can put it on a large Christmas tree. Oh, this is cute. All right, y'all. Y'all hear them talking, don't you? All right, I will see y'all in the next store. I'm at the deli here, y'all, at Publix. Get me a sandwich, give me, me, me and my mother a sandwich. This is 
is the sub that I got for me and my mother. It looks so good up there. I said, you know what, let me get it. And we got it on the white bread. Yes, yes ma'am. Again, y'all, this is a peanut butter and pretzel cluster. I love fall. Here's a pumpkin loaf. And look, a pumpkin spice madeleine. Mm, I wonder how that tastes. And then, of course, this Halloween stuff. Y'all wonder how these taste. Pumpkin pie almonds? A pumpkin pie almonds? Ooh. Mmm. Y'all get this. Let me know how it tastes. <laughs> it's by Durham. Y'all, what is the first thing that I see in Hobby Lobby? The Grinch. When you walk in the foyer. Before y'all get to the store and Merry Christmas. And look, y'all. They got a gingerbread man. And some nuts. Y'all, I'm in Hobby Lobby. Look at all this cute fall decor. That is so cute. I love fall, y'all. And what is this? Some type of silicone molding. This is stuff is just so cute, y'all. Ugh. What I tell y'all about this candy corn? Ew. Oh, fucking stuff. All right, I'm not looking for candles. All right. Yeah, y'all, this is cute. And it says, look, 50% off a of wall decor. I might have to get one of something over here. I'm looking for, like, natural slash chic type of thing. Know, do y'all like any of these? I think this is really cute, y'all. I like that mirror. It's cute. Kind of like this too. Simple, but it's like with the, I like these two together. I feel like that. Hmm. Mindset. Uh, all right. So this is like the little girl stuff behind. They have some other stuff too, yeah. Huh? Oh, I love butterflies. These are cute. I might have to get these, y'all. I love butterflies. I might have to get this. It's a wall sticker. Oh, look at that. Oh, yeah, I think I might get that, y'all. For my adults, work with me here. <laughs> I'm not going to have a little kitty looking room like what I got now. I have something more adult. It is cute. Y'all, this is another section that I think is some all right stuff. I might. That's too cute. Let's see my darling girl. Maybe for little girls though, so I may be looking for something a little bit more. All right, y'all, so the one thing that I got is this. I got the butterflies, the Urban House Design Wall Decors. Now, I love butterflies. I love butterflies. I wanna get really creative with on how I put the butterflies. But yeah, um, just in a section, y'all, my hair. In a section with a lot of pumpkins. <laughs> I love this time of season. They have some really cute fall decor. Really cute for anyone who has a house or an apartment. So cute. This looks kind of realistic, y'all. What y'all think? Got little ridges and knots in it. <laughs> Here's another one. It's a little bit more lighter. All right. Hey y'all, so Ross always has the 
best paintings and portraits absolutely gorgeous i just want to show y'all a few look at this one it has butterflies on it isn't she gorgeous Ooh. here's another portrait of a woman but this is so cute if i had a, like a pink theme room i would definitely get this one and just a lot of nature photos and they have a little bit of everything here y'all i gotta get me one of these things today and look at this wall decor this is cute i like this i like that one too but it's not the color i'm looking for rosses and roses have the best portraits and painting. What in the world is this? Oh, Gucci, little Gucci bag for, look at that. But, um, I'm gonna pick up something from here, y'all. And I think I'm gonna have to call it a day. I'm gonna have to wrap it up. But in the next vlog, hopefully you all will see what I put together. Again, my stuff for the most part is already set in my room. I just wanna upgrade it a little bit more and just get rid of all that blue and the nature thing. I just want to do something that's like a little chic slash nature related. Look at this, y'all. This is cute. I'm gonna get something. I'm gonna get something today, y'all. And then I'm trying to stay under $50. I'm gonna try to stay under $50 or at least $100, y'all. But I will let y'all know what I get when I leave. But in the meantime, I'm gonna be looking at some stuff and see if I can get the biggest bang for my buck. All right, see y'all in a little bit. I'm thinking about getting one of these, y'all. These little. This is pretty. These fake flowers. <laughs> it's something. Y'all, this is what I got so far, though. I had to get her, because y'all know I got them butterflies from Hobby Lobby, so. I have a feeling, and look, it has orange and red. Yeah, baby, we're going to have a good time with this. And I got this because it's really colorful, so I like this one. Okay, y'all, okay, I want to show y'all what I got. So I got this wall decor right, um, decor right here, and it's like a mirror. It's really cute, y'all mirror and has some decorations around it. I love that. Then I got this cute little set, y'all. I don't know what I'm going to put in it, but I'll put something cute in it. I got that. And then, of course, I got my portraits here. And then got this one, that one. And then I got here, y'all. That's what I got so far.